and I like beating the computer. <laughs> it's a game. The video game that 63-year-old Donna Flens is talking about is much more than a game. It's an innovative, balanced training program to help prevent falls. The virtual reality game uses sensors at the ankle, knee, and hip to give patients real-time visual feedback when challenged by obstacles on the screen. Donna is very fearful of falling. She fell eight times this year alone. I don't feel the feet underneath me sometimes, and that causes balance to go. For people like Donna, who suffer from diabetes and peripheral neuropathy, a loss of feeling in the feet, balance is a challenge. With our country's increasing number of diabetes cases and an aging population, falls are the leading cause of death for older Americans. It's a huge issue. About a third of elders uh, over the age of 65 a year fall. It's not uncommon for someone who falls and breaks their hip to go on to be institutionalized or even to die prematurely. That's why this month's Journal of the American Podiatric Medical Association is dedicated to the important role podiatrists play in falls prevention. As a podiatrist, I think that we play a very crucial role in the identification as well as the treatment for patients at risk of falling. There are many occasions where we ourselves will identify a patient who's at risk of falling before even they do. In a first-of-a-kind study, University of Arizona researchers tested the virtual reality balance therapy on 29 diabetes patients with a loss of feeling in their feet and a history of falling. After only four weeks, they found the fun, interactive program was quite effective. We saw an increase of more than 35 percent in improving balance and almost 20 percent improvement of the gait velocity and gait stability. I've improved immensely and I can play again with my dogs. I feel as though it's improved my, my lifestyle. This is Dr. Anna Murray for the JATMO Report.